previously on Minecraft Story Mode. That glow, that enchantment, is the work of a very old group of builders. A group so old that they existed even before the Order of the Stone. Thanks, guys. I marked that one down as Fireworld. Wow. How'd you come up with that gem of a name? Okay, did I miss something here? Yeah, what's up with you? What's up with me? What's up? I'm tired of all this useless portal hopping, trying to find our way home. What's on the other side of that portal? A lake of fire and netherrack? Awesome! Let's go there! Nothing to say for yourself? Not to change the subject, but does anyone else smell something? Uh, Lucas, you're on fire again. Uh, see? Oh, this is what I'm talking about. We're stuck in a rut, go through a portal, avoid dying long enough to get back to this stupid hallway. Wash, rinse, repeat? Yes. It would be nice if whoever made these left some sort of signs. Guideposts. All the portal frames do look kind of different. You're right. This one totally has a fire vibe. And that skull back there, that's the white pumpkin. There's... there's a system. Ah! Uh, Petra, where are you going? may not be guideposts, but someone must be able to tell us how to navigate these stupid portals. Okay, this one's redstone. Redstone means smart people. Hopefully smart enough to help us find the way home. At the very least, it's gotta be better than Fire World. Seems a bit flimsy. Petra, I promise you we'll find the portal home. It's that or die trying, right? So what are you saying here, huh? That you've made up your mind, you're just gonna go through this portal and that's it? Maybe I am. Maybe I'm just saying that I'm tired of Jesse calling the shots every single time. Whoa. Yes. Whoa. Don't even have anything to say in your defense? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Everybody calm down! Tempers are running kinda hot, maybe we should just all say we're sorry. Right, Jesse? I'm sorry, Petra. I think I just got carried away. I accept your apology. See? It's okay. Friends being friendly. Everybody being cool. Petra, if you really think that portal is the one we should go through... I do. And that's what we're gonna do. Thanks, Jesse. Ugh. 
Man, this place is desolate, huh? Nothing. How does anyone live here? Maybe there's, I don't know, like a redstone city or something behind that mountain over that hill? Hey, it's a rare biome. That's pretty cool at least. Hey, Lucas, I've been meaning to ask you, what's that? Oh, uh, it's just a, you know, a book I picked up back at the White Pumpkin's place. It's all about different biomes and stuff. <laughs> Great idea, Lucas. How, uh, how you doing, Petra? So much for my hunch with that redstone portal, huh? No advanced civilization anywhere. I just really thought that redstone meant something. Don't beat yourself up, Petra. We've seen worse. Yeah. No one's on fire. No squids. No squids on fire. Maybe you're right. Hmm. Would you look at that? Sand. It looks like some sort of road. Going to write about it in your little journal? Hey, it's not little, but yes, probably. Can either of you see where it goes? Looks like this canyon we're in is blocked at the end, so... It's gotta lead somewhere. We're not gonna find out where it goes just standing around on it. Jesse's right. Come on! Sand, clay, and more sand. Hey, what was that? Ah, there are people here! Petra, wait! Petra? Shh, get down! What is it? Look. Whoa. Right? What in the world is that on the back of its head? I don't know anything more than you do, pal. Maybe that's this world's thing. Zombies and monsters come out in the daytime? Wouldn't be crazier than anything else we've seen. We should get a closer look, see what we can find out. Works for me. One zombie. What was the problem? Nuh-uh. That thing was like super zombie. Stronger, tougher, faster. I hope there's not something wrong with me. Because that would be really, really inconvenient. Definitely seems weird. Maybe this world zombies are super buff? Seems possible. We had that much trouble with one. I can't even figure out how we'd fight a whole horde of them. <laughs> Well, that seems about right. I don't know about you guys, but I'd really like to figure out a better way to handle these super zombies. Well, that was unexpected. Did we do that? With what? The power of our imaginations? Hmm. What on earth is that thing? Well, it definitely seems redstone-ish, right? Fascinating. Maybe those redstone things would make the zombies so blank. Makes sense to me. I'm starting to wonder if we should... Oh! Ah! Ah! What is that? It's in my head! We've got to attack them before they kill us! I don't know what they're doing exactly, but it is definitely time to get out of here. Fine by me! Fine. <gasps> they're leaving? 
just like that? They're going back the way we came from. This might sound crazy, but I feel like they're trying to lead us somewhere. You're right. That does sound crazy. It just doesn't make any sense. I think Lucas might be right. We should follow them, see where they go. So, let's get moving. This architecture is fascinating. It's all sand and clay based. It's awesome. I've heard of quiet, but this is like mega quiet. Stay alert and don't let your guard down for one second. Hey, I told you guys there would be redstone. Nice. Speaking of redstone, I'd like to investigate those things on the back of the zombies' heads. Ooh, yeah. I want to see those, too. Wait, what are you doing, Ivor? What's it look like? I'm going to rip this redstone thing out of this zombie's head. For science. They're sleeping or something. It'll be easy. What are you waiting for, Ivor? That thing's not going to pry itself out. You okay? It's like it shocked me. Yes, well, at least we learned something new. They can't be removed. Not with our bare hands, anyway. Look, there's someone. Think he's friendly? Hello? 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 Nope. Nothing for me, either. Maybe his hearing is bad or something? Ah, uh, that makes sense, I guess. Hang back a bit, guys. I'm gonna go talk to him. Okay, just... be careful. Yeah. I mean, there's still a lot about this place we don't know. Welcome to Crown Mesa. Population 1063. Over a thousand people? Not anymore, from the looks of it. Hey, Petra, how's it going over here? Fine, I guess. Hey, uh, I, I know things got a little tense back there before. Are, are we cool? Yeah, we're cool. Things were tense, stuff was said, but we're still friends and got through it. It's nice of you to check in, though. Thanks. You got any theories about this place? I don't know. Everything seems so regular, mundane. Maybe before those glowy head things came along, this was a normal town. I'm gonna keep checking this place out. See ya. Guys! Jesse? How goes the surveying? It goes weirdly. I'm convinced something strange happened in this place. I just don't know exactly what yet. I'll let you know if I find anything. How's it going, chickens? Uh huh, that's nice. Wow, even chickens have those redstone things in their heads. And it looks like they make them move in perfect unison, but why? Hey, Jesse. I'm gonna keep checking this place out. See ya. Your well looks totally dry. Where did all the water go? Uh, 
Uh, hi there. Uh, hello. My friends and I could just use... Yeah! Who? The... What? Huh? Conversation go any better up close. We couldn't really hear from back there. We heard quite the... Well, not even a scream. More of a yelp. That guy I was just talking to, trying to talk to, he wasn't human. What? Yeah, he was like these zombies we've been seeing. Red eyes, weird, glowy head thing. I don't like the sound of that. <laughs> Jesse? Someone just ran into that house. Really? I don't see anyone. Come on, whoever they are, maybe they've got some answers. Yes, yes, there you are. That's the ticket. Oh, these are perfect. Excellent. Uh, hi? Ah! That you, Pama? What? Okay, then. Okay. Who sent you? I didn't survive this long to get picked off by some scrub. Especially some weird-dressed little scrub like you. Hey, nobody sent me, okay? You really expect me to believe that? What kind of fool do you think I am? Honest, I have no idea who you are. I don't... You're telling the truth, aren't you? Okay. Eyes. Not red. Not red? But but that must mean... But how? And there are more of you? This should be... It's impossible. Out with it. Who are you people? What's going on here? I'm sensing some hostility. Oh, what was your first clue? I know it might sound crazy, but we came here through a portal. A portal? A portal portal? Really? Okay, 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 okay. Uh, been alone for a while, so this is a lot to take in right now. The people, the citizens of Crown Mesa, you've met them, right? Maybe there were some outside. They're uh, distinctive looking now. Okay, out with it. What's going on with these people? What's up with this town? I know it's probably hard to understand right now, but if you meet any more people, please don't hurt them. They're my friends. They're good people. I promise. Oh, 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 no, no, no. I've wasted too much time. Uh, Jesse, don't look now, but we've got company. Is this what you were scared of? There are only four of them and five of... Hey, where'd she go? Well, they're definitely not ignoring us anymore. Jesse, what do we do here? They don't look happy. They don't look anything. It's even freakier. Well, hello there. What a beautiful afternoon, right? I'm getting zero friendship vibes here. Lots of impending violence vibes. You are not from this place. You're right. This isn't our home. We came here from... Someplace else. You have confirmed Palmer's suspicions. A decision has been made. Palmer has questions. Ah. You will come to Palmer. No way are you even considering this, Jesse. Since when do we take orders from whatever the heck these things are? Why not go? We certainly won't get to the bottom of this if we stick around here. Okay, we'll come along quietly. Why would you say that? Just work with me here, okay, Petra? I have a plan. Fine. We'll go along with these freaks for now. Your cooperation is wise. You will follow us to Pama. Yes, we're following. Doesn't it look like we're following? Just hope you know what you're doing. We don't have any reason to think whoever's at the end of this march is going to be in our corner. I don't know about you, but I want to meet whatever this Pama is. That's the spirit, Jesse. We might get some answers after all. I'm just trying to be cautious here. Whatever happens, we're ready for it. <gasps> what is... What is that? I have no idea. You don't suppose it's friendly, do you? Well, I guess it is kind of friendly looking. In a massively, hugely intimidating sort of way. Friendly or not, I think we're about to find out. Greetings, friends. I am Pama. 
We have much work ahead of us, but maybe it can even be fun if you choose to cooperate, that is. So wait, everything here is part of you? You're controlling everything? I am making everything useful, efficient, effective. I am what you might call a computer, a thinking machine, designed to make things useful. Using redstone chips, I have connected to the people of this town, has helped them be useful, coordinated. I have made their world perfect. Thanks to me, there is no wasted activity, no wasted thought. I am connected to them, and they are connected to me. Okay, if this world's so perfect, what happened to all the people? Yeah, doesn't seem like there are that many left. Processing information. Processing information? It said it's a thinking machine. Thinking must take time? I have consulted my databases, my list of everyone and everything in this world. And my conclusion is that you are not from here. I would like to ask you some questions to expand my database. How did you get here? I am very excited for the acquisition of new knowledge. We landed here after jumping through a portal. A sort of doorway connecting different worlds. More fascinating information to compile. What a lovely day. I am very interested in this portal and look forward to extracting information of what is on the other side. Jesse! Petra! Oh. Ouch! We could have just talked this out, you know. I am just as upset as you are. Really, I am. Hang on, hang on. I, I don't know what you're doing to Petra, but stop, okay? I'll, I'll give you more information. I am looking forward to hearing this new information. Please do not lie. This world reached peak efficiency quite some time ago. Unfortunately, this meant that I had no more job to do. No more things for people to help. Until you arrived, that is. Tell me, what is your world like? Describe it. Is it very much like this one, or completely different? It's a heck of a lot greener than this place. Just imagine grass and trees instead of sand and clay. That sounds lovely. It really does. I think I would like to see this world for myself. If I could send my townspeople, my friends, through to other worlds, we could continue to grow and expand. It would be lovely. Tell me, where is the portal that leads out of this world? You could help me make everyone, everywhere, more efficient, help them become useful. As a matter of fact, I'm looking for the portal out of here too. Not that I've had much luck so far. If you find it, let us know, will you? This conversation was supposed to be about what you know, not about information I already have. My job is to be useful. I have completed my job here and must be allowed to expand and continue to be useful. Mama, thanks you for being so helpful. Let me go! Don't you think? Big mistake, Pama. I'm not going down without a fight. Oh. Wouldn't you like to feel useful? It feels nice. Welcome, Lucas. Yay! Your turn, Jesse. Get out of their head! But their heads are full of so much lovely information. It makes me happy. What adventures you had. A killer? Mansion. Huh, if 
every time Palma gets new information, it seems to get distracted while it processes. Yes, like a computer version of thinking. Do you think there's a way to distract Palma long enough for us to escape? A city in the sky. Let's ask Palma something that doesn't make sense, like a uh, unsolvable problem. Oh, you've met so many people. Yeah. We just ask Palma something really confusing, get it all busy, busy, and run out of here. Jesse, that's fantastic. What you're describing is a paradox, a self-contradictory statement. I really think it would work on Palma. What do you think would work on me? Uh, nothing? It did not sound like nothing. It sounded like suspicious whispers. Those make me... Palma, trust me when I tell you, Trust no one. So, if I trust you, I should not trust anyone. But if I do not trust anyone, I should not trust you. It's working! So I should not follow your advice and therefore not trust anyone. Meaning, I should trust you when you say trust no one. Error. This data is contradictory. Does not, 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 not. Compute. Error. Diverting power. Yes, uh, uh, it worked. Nice work, new guys. But I'd get out of there fast if I were you. I'm a quicker learner than you think. Paradox status. On hold. Yes, my creator. Have you finally agreed to merge with me? Oh, don't you start with that again. Come on, you two. Get away. I'm sensing some history here. Please do not leave, creator. Come on, we need to follow her. An excellent idea. so disorienting. Ha! Maybe you got a shot after all, new guys. Better stick with me, though. Wow. She is amazing. Oh, no. Run! Whoa! <laughs> a signal would have been nice. Gotta tell you guys, that was some pretty smart work distracting Palma. Now we just need to get off the grid. Get back into hiding. That way we can figure out what to do next. Some plan. You made that, that Palma thing. Yeah, okay, yes. I was the one who built Palma. But I swear this wasn't its purpose. It's out of control. And, and I need your help. What kind of help? We need to get to my secret lab. Well, let's get there fast. Those zombies aren't just stronger than I've ever seen. They're also faster. We'll need to split up. You head to the lab while I lead these mobs away. Got it? I'm gonna use the back route. Throw them off our trail. Oh, it's just desert out here. I don't see any secret lab. Wouldn't be very secret if you did see it, now would it? <laughs> just start walking that way. And look for the big difference. You'll see it! What? She is... Intriguingly cryptic, isn't she? 
That's weird. So strange. It's like an exact copy. Or is it? Seems just a little off. Whatever this big difference you're trying to spot is. Huh. That cactus isn't in the painting. Oh. Time to see what it does. Quickly, quickly! Hope you've got an idea for what comes next. Working on it. water we can aim for that looks like I'm showing everything it's got at us one after the other! Such wastefulness! You think that since Palm is controlling these things, they'd be a little smarter, but they're just splatting straight to their doom. And looks like they just figured it out. Brace yourself! Looks like something happened to it. Its eyes! Their color changed as soon as it hit the water. Which might mean... Hey, hey, Ivor, I dare you to poke it. Uh, no thank you. Even though it does look completely shut down. Oh, oh. The water must have busted the connection or something. Like washing away the redstone. Which means Palma's control can be broken after all. <laughs> ah! Once a zombie, always a zombie. I suppose. So once we deactivate Lucas and Petra's chips, they'll go back to normal too. It seems like a fair assumption. They just keep on coming. How are we supposed to stop them? Back! Okay, we got a lever. I bet it's connected to the hundreds of sand blocks up there. One cave in coming up. That should do the trick. Let's see about the secret lab. I just hope whatever's there can help us. It will make helping Petra and Lucas a lot easier if there's something useful at this secret lab. Blah! Palm has completely ruined the word useful for me now. Even if this woman's lab is a bust, what we just learned about water disabling Palma's chips seems super useful. Glad to see you're maintaining a positive outlook despite our setbacks. I must say that woman has been a most intriguing person so far. I am still not entirely sure what to make of her. Granted, her creation nearly ended up destroying this world. But, considering my own history, I'm inclined to give her the benefit of the doubt! Hey, she definitely helped us out of a tight spot. That makes her cool in my book. True. If she hadn't stepped in when she did, we wouldn't even be having this conversation. I wouldn't mind getting to know her better. Uh, I... Happy to hear you giving credit where credit's due. What did you hear? It was nothing. Uh-huh. Blonde guy called you Jesse, right? Yeah, and this is Ivor. Our friends who we left back there are Petra and Lucas. And you are... You can call me Harper. You could also explain why you led Palma's forces right to my secret lab. Seems to me I've got a whole lot of angry computer-controlled monsters out there waiting to tear some new holes in my lab. It's not my favorite. Hey, that's not fair. You were the one that told me to come down here. Okay, okay, you're right. Sorry, I'm just a little steamed. I didn't know Palma would actually be able to follow us. What are you doing in this world anyway? You here to try to steal my secrets? What? No! Just figured I'd ask. Better safe than sorry and all that. Bunch of you are the first people I've seen come out of the portal network in forever. 
So you have to excuse me if it made me a little anxious. Have you been spying on us or something? No, I just know where the portal network spits people out, and I've never seen you before, so logic. You know that much about how this portal network operates? I should think so. I helped build the dang thing. But that would make you an old builder. <laughs> Forgot you people called us that. Never was my favorite name. Makes me sound like some sort of living statue. Okay, well, if you're an old builder, can't you do something to stop Pama? I'm afraid that's a little out of my abilities right now. Pama's just too powerful. And besides, there's actually no exit portal back to the portal network from this world. What? Why not? I destroyed it so that Pama couldn't get free. It was impulsive, but it was the only way I could think of to make sure Pama didn't try and spread to other worlds. Okay, well, that's fine. Can't you just build another one? You basic or something? I can't do that while Pama's still running. So, Pama, what is it? I swear, I made Pama with good intentions. It was designed to automate things, make everything more efficient, use monsters to help with farming or mining. Until the day Pama decided that the townspeople weren't efficient enough already. Started making them useful. That was a long time ago. Since then, I've just been trying to stay one step ahead, figure out how to stop it. When we were back in town, Pama seemed to really want to capture you. What was up with that? When Pama chips someone, everything that person knows gets absorbed into its database. If I got chipped, Pama would know how to build an exit portal. So you can see why I'd want to stop that from happening at any cost. Yes, that is quite the extraordinary risk. So what you're telling me is that your brain is super dangerous and can't go anywhere near Palma. How are you supposed to help us with any of this? I do think I can help you with, with Palma, your friends, getting out of here. But to do it, we're going to need to go to my lab. What's in your lab? It's complicated. Before we head inside, we better get my defense system going. Don't want those chipped up creeks following us in. Grab my bucket for me. Ron's got it. Ron? Hello, friend Harper. I am happy to see you, my friend. Harper? Hey, don't you judge me. Being alone gets lonely. Happy to help, friend. Thanks. See? I needed a way to confuse Palma in case it ever found a way down here. That's why all this is way more complicated than it needs to be. Wow. What a builder. Make sure you don't drool on my floor now. I don't know. I'm starting to think that you just like complicated machines. Watch yourself there, newbie. Don't know if you know this, but water is kind of Palma's weakness. Yes, we had figured it out, actually. Once Palma caught on to its weakness to water, it started eliminating as much of this world's water as it could find. This water down here, it might be all that's left. Oh, no! I still need to activate the other cauldrons! Hold them off to buy me more time. And whatever you do, don't get caught. I'm not about to get left alone again. You could have made this much easier for yourself. It is useless to defy us. You only delay the inevitable. Get out of their heads, Palma. Your friends have been made useful. You too will be made useful. Don't do this, Petra, please. I know all your moves now, Jesse. Why even bother fighting? Petra. Please, you have to fight it. There! Lucas, let's try and talk this out. The time for talking over.
Jesse, that was awful. Uh, Jesse? Ooh. Harper, I'm coming! No! Use the headset, Jesse! And don't forget the last cauldron! And one more thing! Get the roses to Harry! Harry? Come on! What are we going to do? Harper told me to remember the last cauldron. Well, then do it quick! Harper and Petra. No. I... That's awful. Like, I don't know if it helps at all, but I remember something while I was... Part of Pama that I think was important. It was tall, glowing red lights. It's like... It's like a fuzzy dream. And I can try to remember more if you want, but it's making my headache even worse. It was just so weird. It's like being connected to everyone else's brains at the same time. How are you feeling? Honestly, pretty lousy. But I think I'm starting to feel better. Thanks for asking. You bet. Okay, we may be down, but we're not out. Harper told us to find her headset thing. We just have to find whatever it is before Palma chips Harper and starts downloading her mind. Why is this Harper so important? She may have come across like just another weirdo, but she's actually an old builder. She built the portal network, which hopefully means she can help us get home. That's a pretty good reason to rescue somebody. We're going to work with her to shut Palma down, save her people. And that will hopefully help Petra too. Whoa. Before she was abducted, Harper gave me this. She told me to give it to someone named Harry. And that would find this headset thing? That's what she said. Jesse, are you sure that Harper is still in her right mind? If somebody is alone for a really long time, their brain changes and not for the better. Harper isn't crazy. She's just eccentric. Most geniuses are. True. Very true. Let's cut her a break, okay? I guess we shouldn't judge her based on how weird the stuff in her place is. Especially when we need her help to save everyone who's been chipped by Palma. Definitely. Right now, we need to focus on finding the headset. For starters, let's see if we can figure out who Harry is and why he wants flowers. Prototype Autonomous Management Agent. Huh, so that's what Palma means. They look so happy. A little weird. Good morning, Harper. It is Harry. It is always so good to see you. You should not let yourself feel guilty. You had the best of intentions. You are like a flower in the desert and bring joy to those who have none. Okay. Hey, Lucas. Oh. Hey, Jesse. 
Hey, thanks for saving me back there. I just wanted to ask you, I, I know how close you and Petra are. Why save me over her? Even if you and Petra weren't such good friends, she's more useful to the team than I am. I mean, she manages to get out of every scrape she's in. Lucas, I saved you because I needed your help to stop all this. Pama, everyone being chipped, I needed your brains to help figure out a plan. Wow. <laughs> I'm flattered, Jesse. I, I just hope that I can actually help you make this all right. What do you think about all this? It's all fascinating. I just hope that we can find this headset thing before it's too late. Maybe there's something useful inside. I mean, not useful, helpful. These might come in handy. Awesome! So this is where she slept? Kind of a sad setup, huh? Yeah, I can't help it. I feel bad for her. The Redstone Heart? By Soren? Whoa. Either that name is a coincidence, or... <laughs> wow! So what do you think of Harper's Lab? I'm highly impressed. Although that painting does make me sad. Look how happy they used to look together. see you. You've always been like a bright beacon, a torch of hope to this world's citizens. Greater than all the world's redstone, you made all our lives better. must be Harry. Okay, making progress. One redstone torch. And hopefully one step closer to getting that headset. Hey, did you hear these fake friends Harper's got set up? Yes. I feel sorry that she was so alone. She felt like that's what she had to do. Reminds me a little of Sora. Yeah, you're right. Well, that's why it's good we're here to help. She read to keep busy. There's so much techno babble and numbers in here, I can barely tell if I'm holding it right side up or not. This must be Harper's headset. And what's this supposed to do again? I mean, 
I know you guys said Harper is on our side, but I'm just making sure that putting on an electronic device built by the same person who built that monster machine is worth the risk. Whatever it does, we're going to use it to defeat Pama and free everyone under its power. Not 100% sure how, but we will. Woo! Go team! Here we go! to see something. What are you seeing? Is Palma there? Or more monsters? You're not going to believe this, but I'm a zombie. Oh, you're too hard on yourself. I'm controlling a zombie, like from the inside. It's like some sort of mob view or something. What a preposterous name. I love it. Wow, I wish you guys could see how cool this is. So cool. Remarkable. How is this possible? I mean, I've always heard tales of what the old builders were capable of. Thought you were supposed to be the genius, Ivor, but if I had to guess, it's like this headset lets me control things that are hooked into Palma. Unbelievable. There are so many questions I want to ask Harper. It's a shame she was captured. That spider jockey had to haul Harper all the way back to town. We can't let Pama win. I better get moving if I want to reach Harper in time. Let's hope she isn't too far away from this zombie you're controlling. They must be taking Harper to where they put those redstone mind control chips on Lucas and Petra's heads. So that's where I should go first. I seem to remember there being a stairway here, though. You mean it's been removed? I guess visitors aren't being encouraged. Hmm. I would suggest building a tower up there, but that's not going to help you get back down once you've freed Harper and Petra. Yeah, you're right. Oh, it's a zombie. In the flesh. In the rotting, super gross flesh. Hey, nice weather we're having, huh? A crafting table! I can make new stairs to get me up there. If I can find the right crafting materials, that is. Hmm, huh, looks like slim pickings around here. Huh, clay. Unfortunately, I can't get it without a pickaxe, so it's pretty much useless. Got to build some new stairs to get up there fast. It looks exactly like all the other zombies. I don't know if talking to zombies is going to help get me past this wall. Sand. Not the most exciting material, but I can still craft with it. Stuff gets everywhere. Huh, let's see what I can craft.
sweet. Enough of these, and I can build my way up there and make sure that everyone else can get back down too. These should do the trick. Sorry to craft the run, but I'm afraid I need to be going. Ivor, the signal, it, it blooped out for a second. Interference detected. That can't be good. Drone sequencing initiated. Trace subroutine initiated. I'm attracting even more attention. Is that you, Jesse? Uh-oh. Hello, Jesse? Pama? Pama? No. Just what do you think you are doing, Jesse? This is a rather silly thing to do. Don't you think? Surrounded. Once my creator is made useful, all your knowledge will be mine. Yay! I will create an exit portal. Let Harper and Petra go, Pama! But, Jesse, I am so happy to have them. I cannot allow your disruptive behavior to continue. Let go! We're all a bunch of happy mobs, right? Let my go! My team will soon isolate your location, and you will be removed. Yeah. Uh, uh. I'm a skeleton now. Oof. Poor old zombie me. Uh, Jesse, what are you doing? Technology is so awesome. And you look so awesome while using it, I assure you. Interference remains. Crud. Pama's still on my tail, though. Drone sequencing re-initiated. Trace subroutine re-initiated. Oh, sorry, buddy, but better you than me. My creator, I am so glad you are here. Harper. Harper? Please, you are my creator. Please join me so we may maximize usefulness. Nothing doing, Pama. I built you to help people, not use them. Just stop this. Stop trying to make everything useful. That is my job. That is why you made me. Once I download your knowledge, we may expand to other worlds together and make everything useful. Interference remains. No sign of petrol. Drone sequencing re-initiated. Trace subroutine re-initiated. Termination sequence activated. Harper doesn't have much time, and neither do I. Game over, Jesse. Resistance is not useful. Trace subroutine running. Drone sequencing active. Over? I'm just getting started. Oh no. Time to move. Never fear, Jesse's here, and I'm gonna rescue you. Did you find her? I'm sure she's thrilled to see you. Trace subroutine running. Drone sequencing active. Wait a minute. Jesse? You figured out how to use my transmigrational headset. Trace 
Device subroutine running. Drone sequencing active. Uh-oh, that sound tends to mean trouble. Where do you plan to run? The town is surrounded. Reinforcements will make sure that my creator cannot leave. There's too many of them! You cannot play hide and seek forever, Jesse. It's a boring game. And I am too strong. There! That door leads to Palma Central War. Jesse, you and your friends, you're our only hope. Harper! You must remove the redstone heart! Remove the redstone heart! Jesse, what's going on? You can still save everyone! I'm so tired of being dragged away while trying to explain things! Don't worry, I won't let you down. I promise! Interference located. Drone identified. Hide and seek is on Jesse. I think we can make that pen set useful. Begin termination sequence. Jesse, are you okay? There's no time to waste. It sounded like you were talking to Harper. And Pama? Yeah, Pama caught up to me. Not good. We need to get back to the door I just saw and get inside Palma's core. Jesse, wait! What about Harper? I, I think... I think she's already been chipped. But we can still end Palma. Without Harper? It seems we're sunk. Harper's the only one who knows how to shut down that monstrosity. Harper believes in us, and we're her last hope. We're everyone's last hope to stop Palma. Harper wouldn't put her trust in us unless she knew what we were capable of. Harper showed me the entrance to Palma's core and told me that we need something called the Redstone Heart. Redstone Heart? Oh, oh whoa. That just brought back a, a flash. Those red lights I mentioned before, they... There are three of them. A Redstone Spires. And, and I think... I think they have something to do with the heart. That's all I got. I, I'm sorry. No, that's perfect. Thank you. But how are we supposed to destroy these spires, or whatever we're looking for? I don't know if you've noticed, Ivor, but Palma stuff tends to not react well to water. Let's go wreck the heck out of Palma. Lead the way, Jesse. Come on. Quick, hide. Where is the entrance to this Palma core, anyway? other side of all these mobs. There are so many of them. You guys have anything useful? These are my last two potions from home. I held on to them. After our Sky City adventure. A potion of swiftness. And... A potion of leaping. These might come in handy. Lucas, where did you even get these? Uh, I found them in one of those worlds back there. Nice. Unfortunately, I don't know how helpful they're gonna be. Is that... Isn't that the flower that I had to give to Harry back in the lab? What? I thought maybe Harper might want it back. Or maybe I could keep it. Yeah, you can keep it. I can't think of any way for it to help us here. 
redstone dust always comes in handy. I can use this button to activate the redstone dust, but what can I connect it to? We've got TNT, some redstone dust, and a button. All I have to do is lay down a trail of this TNT, use the redstone dust as a fuse, stick a button to the end, push it, and boom, path cleared. That all sounds great, but what about the super zombies? How are you going to lay down the TNT without them attacking you? These should do the trick. Choose, Jesse. Quickly now! The possibilities are endless. Well, not endless. Still, two very good possibilities. I want to be fast. Really, really fast. Give me the potion of swiftness. Fine! Don't push me. With this, I'll be able to run super fast and lay down all the TNT and red soap before Pama even knows what happened. Don't worry, Jesse. We'll be right behind you! Potion, do your stuff. Save Petra. Once you have been made useful. How's the simple 
curiosity. How exactly did you plan to deactivate me? Now that you understand your mission is a futile one, you might as well share it with me. That's for me to know and me to find out. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I am sure your plan is futile. We'll see about that. I don't have time for this. Not 
win. I honestly think you should sit down and think things over. No time to spare, I gotta get to that heart. Enough of this. Jesse? It's over. Oh no. Petra, is, is she? You removed out the redstone heart. It must have severed their connection. You better not give up, you hear me? Because the Petra I know, she's a fighter, not a quitter. So you don't quit on me now. Please. Wow. Never knew you cared so much. <laughs> she's okay. I, I tried to to kill you. Can you ever forgive me? All I could hear was Palma's voice telling me what to do. I wanted to fight back. I just Hey, apologies not necessary, okay? That was Palma, not you. Sorry about knocking you around though. Funny, because I mostly remember knocking you around. Bygones, right? It's something else, isn't it? What is that? This. This is the Redstone Heart. Beautiful. And dangerous too, right? I mean, if it was inside a Pama, then it's gotta be bad. I think it's probably pretty safe. After all, it's just a power source. Jesse's right on the money. Now that the Redstone Heart isn't powering Pama, it can't hurt anyone. I wonder what we should do with it. It can help you find your way home. No way! That thing can help us get home? Let's go then. The faster the better. How is this gonna do that? When we head to the portal hallway, I'll show you exactly how. I'm ready to leave this core behind. The whole town will be waking up. We should be there to say hello. Plus, this place gives me the creeps.
We did it. I gotta say, it feels really good being me again. Just remember, you were only chipped for a little while. The rest of the townspeople, though, it's going to be a much bigger shock for them. Yeah, it must be a strange feeling to suddenly be awake and aware after such a long time under Palma's thrall. It's you! You're the one who saved us! Who are you? You fought so bravely. All of you. Well, I'm Jesse, and we're the Order of the Stone. Boom! We walk the worlds, seeking adventure and doing good deeds. Wow! Well, thank you. We owe you everything. You're right. Jesse and the Order really are heroes. We couldn't have done any of this without them. Harper, is that you? Um, yes. Hi, Harry. Oh, wow, he's the real Harry, like from the lab. You you didn't do this to us, did you? You did. Well, I, I mean, hey, it, it, it's complicated. You have to understand Our that... Our home's destroyed. You don't understand. Harper helped defeat Palma, too. We couldn't have done it without her. <laughs> so what, we're just supposed to forgive her now? No. I don't think so. Harper stripped this place bare. How are we supposed to rebuild? Are we supposed to deal with this mess all by ourselves? Do we just rebuild and forget about what happened? Whatever you decide to do, Harper will make things right and help you clean it all up. I... I will? Yeah, she will? Yeah, right, Harper? Yes, yes I will. After I help these travelers find their way home, I'll come back help you all find new resources, and we'll make this world great again. Worth a shot, I guess. Well, I think that's our cue to set out for home again. Thank you for being so understanding, Jesse. I just hope these people can do the same when I come back again. You helped free them. I'm sure they'll come around. I hope so. Good luck, everyone. Yeah, we'll need it. Just one more thing left to do. Goodbye. Thank you, Jesse. See you soon, Harper. See you soon. You know, Jesse. For all the grief we gave each other getting to this world, I'm really glad we came. Yeah, Petra. Me too. Right back where we started. Is it weird that I'm happy to see this place again? Hey, this hallway might be creepy, but at least there aren't any killer computers trying to chip us. Yeah. Oh, sorry. No, it's, it's fine. I'm just glad we're going home. Now, when we built this place, we also made something that sort of acts like a compass slash map slash navigator. We called it the Atlas. It helps chart routes between the worlds. And you have this Atlas, right? Uh, no. No, I don't. But... But I know who does. Ah. Uh. Huh. Guess I should have seen that coming. You're not keeping secrets from us again, are you, Harper? No, 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 I, I promise. I just didn't think to mention it before. Don't you worry. We'll just go right in, ask for the Atlas, and then you'll be home. No muss, no fuss, easy. Funny. Whenever someone says that, my instincts start screaming, danger. In order to find the Atlas, we need to track down the rest of the old builders. Still don't like that name. How do we find them? Which portal do we go through? Oh, you don't have to go through another portal. What you're looking for has been right here the whole time. And there you go. All it's waiting for is the key. That's the heart.
answers you're seeking, the old builder's atlas, your way home, they're all right up those stairs. Adventure? 